Good evening and welcome to Arise and Build Prayer Night. I'm so glad that you're with us. Listen, I'm going to pray and I'm going to lead us, but but if you're not even watching this on Thursday night, would you just pray with us and, and for us and, and just use this time to pray? We're so glad that you joined us. And so I'm going to get started. Here we go. God, thank you so much for the call you've given Bar Church to Arise and Build. Thank you so much that you have this beautiful call on our church. It's bigger than a building. It's it's more than just acquiring land. It's, it's more than, than just a hill. It's a vision that you've given us, Father, and it's a call that you have for us to be people that trust you, people that expect you to do for us what we could never do for ourselves. It's It's literally like the gospel even being played out, you doing for us what we never could do. Father, I just want to start our prayer time. And, and, and I know that I, my prayer is that, that it's more than just me praying, that, that people would just use this time to pray. And so as I just start us off, Father, I just want to ask for us to be people that will rise, people that will go to the next level, that we will mature this year. We will grow this year. Father, I want to pray for our church, that we would have faith that is big and strong and trust you to do big and strong things in our lives. I want to pray, Father, for us to be obedient, uh, for us to to stay in step with the Spirit, Lord, for Bara to to trust you as a good, good Father. God, I, I want to ask that your will is done in our church, in our lives, as it is in heaven, Father. And, and I pray, Lord, that we would not be scared. We would not be fearful. We would be strong and courageous. Lord, we would know that it is you, Father, that leads us, you that is for us. And if you're for us, Father, who who could be against us? Lord, wherever we are in life, whatever we're facing, I pray that tonight is a reminder that we face it with you if we are in Christ. And Father, if there's anybody watching this, anybody that's watching this uh, days, weeks, months, years from now, and they've not given their life to you, Father, I pray they would do that, Lord. I pray that they would let you be their Lord and not just their Savior, but their Savior as well. Father, I pray for those that are hurting right now. Church is commanded to do that. We're called to do that, Father. Help the church not be a group that hurts people, but helps people. Uh, To be a group that blesses people. To be a family that functions in the area of healing and kindness and compassion. Father, I pray for the for the world, Lord, for the disunity in our world, for that we would be one. That that was your prayer, Father. Uh, The night before you died, Jesus, you prayed for unity. And so we echo that prayer. God, thank you so much for the call you've given Bar Church. And I just pray now as we continue this prayer that we would seek you and hear you and follow you. I I remember, Father, the scripture uh, that you gave us early on in, in like the fall of 2013 from Nehemiah, where Nehemiah says, hey, the God of heaven has given us success. Therefore, we, his servants, will rise and build. We will arise and build. Lord, let us do that. Let us be about that. Thank you, Father, for hearing our prayer and let our prayer continue now. Through Jesus, I ask it. For a church I love. Amen. All right, let's keep praying.